hard. Like, oh, 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 right here with Blaze, still a Blaze. What's up, man? He just had the pro debut on the Jetta Promotions cards. It was a good, entertaining fight to start the bout off. Um, how you feel? I feel good. I feel real good. Uh, I feel like I learned a lot. Um, you know, like a lot of pro debuts, a lot of the nerves kind of get to you. Um, I wouldn't let my hands go. You know, I'm very hypercritical myself. I mm. um, wouldn't let my hands go like I should have, like I normally do. Um, but, you know, I started feeling more comfortable as the round started getting uh, getting going. Um, I wasn't really tired at all throughout the uh, entire fight. Uh, so I know that I can push the four rounds at a very high pace if need be. So I got some things I got to work on. I look forward to getting back in the lab sometime this week and just perfecting my craft, man. This is what it's all about. So, I had a lot of Navy support out there, so I want to thank all the Navy guys that came out for my command. I really appreciate you guys. You guys have given me so much support. I love all you guys. Thank you so much. Now, were you a little bit overexcited? Uh, during the fight? Yes. Yeah, I feel like, um, you know, typically, and again, hypercritical myself, I'm usually like a slow starter. Um, so it takes me a little bit to kind of get warmed up, kind of get the feel of the fight, kind of get, you know, whatever. My coaches know that I will do so much better in a more, uh, more rounds, um, so like six, seven, eight um, round fight um, than I would do in like a four round. Um, so, yeah. Mm. And he hit you with a couple shots. Every time he hit you, you shook your head no. Yeah. Um, you know, did you feel anything? Not really? Um, you know, he was, he hit good, um, but you know, I have a really strong chin, uh, you know, so he's a really good puncher, um, he's a really great fighter, and, like, all credit to him, it's a very tough and close fight, um, and I look forward to doing it in the future, but, I mean, not really, you know, it was kind of like making me smile a little bit, um, you know, it was good, solid, solid shots that I wanted to acknowledge, like, that was a good punch, man, you know, good job, congratulations, so I'm going to try to go get my back now, so that's all it is. But anything else you think you could have did better? Uh, to not get hit with, you know, the shots you got hit with? Uh, a little bit more head movement. Uh, I think it was a little bit more... Um it was really different with the eight pound or eight ounce gloves. Um, you know, they don't give you as much protection. They don't give you as much uh, you know, comfort when you're up here. You gotta be a little bit higher guard to be able to protect your ears and your face a little bit more. So that's something I'm really gonna work on in the future. Because during sparring, you got the 16 ounce gloves, you got the head gear, you got everything else like that. So it's a little bit more protection. So that's something I'm really gonna work forward to and look, uh, look to doing in the future. What shots you think work for you tonight? Uh, I, I think, know you went to the body a lot. You were trying to throw jabs to the body. Yeah, I think that I got a little bit too excited for the body punches. Um, I'm, I love throwing body punches. That's my that's one of my fortes. But if you see me in the amateurs, the body is, is all day. So if you give me the opportunity, I, I guarantee I'll take it. Um, I think the one that really, really worked was overhand right, and he saw that coming. So every time he would miss a jab or I'd slip a jab, he would duck his head down. Um, and uh, so after I hit him just a couple times with that, he really didn't want to get hit with that hand. And I did know I really did hurt him in, uh, I think it was the second round. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, but, you know, he's a great chin, great fighter, nothing but the best thing to say about him. Um, and so, yeah. All right, the crowd was whooping and hollering. They would like to see rematch between you two. Um, how soon can we see you back in the ring? Well, so this is actually my last day in active duty Navy. So okay. I just transitioned into the reserves as of tomorrow. Um, so I would like a little bit of downtime, spend time with my family. Eight and a half years in the Navy, you know, traveling everywhere, going to 22 different countries, two deployments, you know, spending all my time boxing and everything like that. It's kind of really made me miss a lot of the family things. So maybe sometime early next year, maybe mid next year, um, I just would like to take some downtime. All right. Yeah. Blaze any social media sites we follow you at? Uh, Facebook, uh, Blaze Fiddler, and then um, Instagram at Blaze Fiddler Hernandez. Right, with Featherweight, Blaze Fiddler, Blaze, thank you for your time, Blaze. Thanks so much, Mike. No problem. Thank you.